I have the plants you need. Good, good. Once added to the elixir, it will be ready to drink. In taking this, you will have access to the All Father's wisdom. You will walk the path of Odin and live as he lived so long ago. Prepare yourself for a journey into another time, another plane. The elixir is ready. It will taste like misery itself, but it will open your mind to the sights and sounds of the Nine Worlds. Prophecies of the Nornir are as clear as daylight. The Aesir are doomed. All Asgard is doomed. Repeat the last passage. Brothers will fight one another and kill one another. The home of the gods turns red with gore. It will be an age of storms. An age of wolves. Not this. Further along. The foretelling of a wolf great beast. The wolf Fenrir howls terribly before the gates to hell. The beast will break its bonds and run. And my part? What about me? Then comes the second great sorrow. When the Harvey goes to fight the wolf and falls to Fenrir. And falls to Fenrir. It's there, you see. You have foretold my death. Your Harvey will die. We speak what we see. We know your fate, your destiny. Have you gleaned enough, O oh wise one? You three spin our destinies as a thread in fabric. But threads may be unraveled by snags and catches. Not all can be foreseen. But loose threads can be rewoven or restrung. At day's end, the tapestry will be preserved. I am no string to be plucked or tied. I am the High One, the Lord of Ecstasy, the enemy of the Wolf. I am eternal.
Riddled words only cloud my thoughts. A storm is brewing. Not in the clouds, but down below. Does our final battle draw near? Is this how Ragnarok begins? Devise a strategy to deal with these invaders, Thor. You cannot smash your way out of who is balls. We are as guardians. We don't skulk around like elves. We fight. We are fighting for our homes, for our people. But some problems can't be solved with the hard end of a hammer. Name one. Harvey, break our stalemate. What is this? Another invasion? Warriors from Jotunheim. They attack from all fronts. While we sit on our trembling hands and scratch our bums. Not so, Thor. Many Aesir have been sent to the four corners of Asgard, leaving we four to defend the Great Hall. Havi, lend me a score of your warriors and I will lead them into Jotunheim myself. We cannot afford such a loss. The Ain Hariar must hold back to defend our city. I would bring them here. To hold the Great Hall itself. This invasion is too large to spread ourselves around. All this prattle solves nothing. Battle or death! Silence! All of you. We will take the fight to the enemy before they cross the Bifrost. Well said, Ravenfeeder. Name those who may fight beside you. I need only one. You, Thor, Lord of Thunder. Together we'll cripple the enemy before they grow too bold. Rouse every warrior who can hold axe or hammer. We're hunting Jotnar heads! The rest of you, stay back to protect the Great Hall. Were any creatures among the Jotnar? Drago, trolls, or wolves? What troubles you, Havi? Does your far side tell you something? More invaders! They gather at the Bifrost Bridge! Where's Loki? He should be guarding that door! Warn the others. The fight begins. Ein Herjar! Here is the battle you died to attain! For Heavy and for Asgard! <laughs> you should hide scum! Welcome to your doom! Warriors, 
with me. The rest of you guard the Great Hall. With me, I gift this battle to myself. Einherjör, bring the heavy your blades. We will drown our enemies in blood.
What's that? You've done us no favors either, Jotun. Wait, no. You're, you're mistaken. I am no Jotun. I was only passing through from one land to another. Would your song be the same if the Jotna had won this fight? Yes, of course. Uh, uh. Harvey. I found this one lurking in the shade, shying from battle. Shall I extract some teeth to get him talking? Or pluck out an eye? You were told to guard this portal, Loki. What happened? The portal opened, and these soldiers came bleeding through. So I sent warning straight away. And I captured this one, the soggy jowled sheep herder. <coughs> <laughs> what is your name, stranger? I am called the Builder by most. He wants your name, not your trade. If I have another name, it's not within my memory. Builder it's been for as long as I've been building things. And what can you build that would impress me? I work with stone, wood, metals, whatever is at hand. And I finish by infusing my work with subtle charms and wishes. Did the Jotnar benefit from these charms and wishes? Oh, for a time, for a time. But you and I both know the Jotnar are a dull and desperate race. Harvey, when someone gifts you a horse, you ride it. I put a bridle on this one. Is that right, Builder? Are you a gift horse? Or a secret curse? Neither, Hywan. I am only a tool. One with hopes to be well used. This portal has been a source of misery for some time. I want it sealed. With respect, this is not the only way the Jotnar can enter Asgard. May I propose a more encompassing solution? And what do you want in exchange for the shield, other than your freedom? I must give that a thought, a very deep thought. It would not be a simple task, and I do have my reputation to consider. If you doubt me, I could offer a demonstration. A demonstration, yes. And if he fails to impress, we hoist his skin as a sail. I'll accept these terms, with the last condition. I would need water from your well of Ulf. What do you know of our sacred well? It's a place of great power and vital magic, a source of spirit. It's the water there that will power your shield. I'll collect the water, Harvey. Keep this one clear of our sacred sites. Loki, halt. I will go to the well. You must find this builder clearing for his display. No, no, it's no trouble, Harvey. The damp and the dark appeal to me. Go with the Builder, then return to the Great Hall with news of our next step. As you command. An interesting offer. A curious coincidence.
so cold. Oh, Scotty, <laughs> I cursed the day you were seized with lust for my perfect legs. Go back to your frigid mountains. The sea is my mistress. Nyorla, your drunken laments ripple through Asgard. What has brought you to this state? I have a beautiful <clears throat> beach home in Neutun. The most perfect place in all Asgard. But is it enough to make Skadi happy? <laughs> no. She wants us to freeze up in the fucking mountains. She is Jotun. You should have known this before you married her. She chose me. Can I help it that I have such beautiful feet? You cannot keep this up. Your wailing will summon a sea storm. I care not. I have mead enough to keep me warm till... till Dilskadi and... Her clan return to their frigid homeland. Maybe they will, but not before plundering the vast riches from your beautiful home. I had not thought of that. By Emir's balls, I must return to shore. Bring me a boat. I still have my pride. I refuse to swim like a fish. Fisher, fisherman. Bring me a boat. Scotty! Scotty! Her heart is as cold as her mountain peaks. Having a Jotun for a wife cannot be easy. The only time she ever really smiled was when that coat nearly ripped Loki's balls off. I remember thinking, that one is cruel. And magnificent! But the pleasure was not worth the pain. And now I have her whole, whole cursed clan to deal with. I know a rune that will dull the edges of their weapons. Only if it will blunt her tongue.
hope you find peace, noble Njorda. A bad match can be troublesome, but not worse than having nothing to love. My home at Noatun will bring me pleasure enough. But what about you, wily one? What do you love? Knowledge, Sea King, and the pursuit of it. Untangling mysteries, uncovering lore. That is what feeds me. Then from what I know of the world and all of the realms, you will never go hungry. Þeir eru að 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 að
Thoughts are clouded with shadows of doom. Even this peaceful valley seems to hold hidden dangers. to be will join us on this wild hunt? Which among you hunger for a challenge, eh? Who here has an appetite for adventure? Hail, Andrimnir. Off again to hunt the immortal boar? Yes. 
Yet again, Seyrimnir has risen from his bones and escaped my kitchen. It should prove to be a vigorous chase. You never tire of tracking this beast. <laughs> no hunt is more thrilling, and his meat has no equal. Come! You sluggards! Have you no appetite? This meat is not to be missed! Take care! He is cunning! Seyrimnir is as deadly as he is delicious! It is worth risking death for the meal of your life! Skillfully done, Lord Keeper! I will save you the juiciest cut! Come, you brave butchers! Let us prepare a true hero's feast! Weapons will not harm me. I will bathe in your blood. Warrior, put reins upon your battle lust and ride it. Do not be written by it. I do not know your face. But I know... Yes, think. What are your last memories? I remember the fire fog. Filling my throat. Wading through a sea of blood and meat. A spear 
piercing my heart. And then the Valkyries plucked you from the Hellvigor, which leads lesser men to Hell, and brought you here, to glorious Asgard. Asgard? This place is truly like no other. And... Uh, this is not a dream? Am I supposed to fight you? We will fight together, and become part of the greatest army ever assembled. But first, go eat and drink among the gods. Take your place in the Hall of the Slain. Your bravery has earned it. Thor! Stormbringer! I offer you my blade! Odin! Ravenfeeder! I give you my life! 